This is a video about longer lasting contraceptive methods, which do not require you to take a pill every day or your partner to use a condom every time you have sex. These methods are similar in effectiveness to you being sterilized when you are using them, but you will be able to get pregnant again as soon as they are taken out. If you have just had a baby, you may have lots on your mind and women often say that they find it hard to remember to take something every day, so longer acting methods are particularly useful. Most women release an egg about one month after having a baby. This means that if you are bottle feeding or mixed feeding, you can fall pregnant weeks after having a baby. It can take a bit longer if you are breastfeeding, but can still happen in the months after delivery. If you do not want to become pregnant immediately after having your baby, we recommend you start contraception straight away. Most methods can be started in the days after you have had your baby. Rather than having to make another visit to your doctor, you may want to start these before you leave the hospital, after you've had your baby. All of the methods we are going to talk about today are safe whether you are planning to breastfeed or bottle feed your baby. So it doesn't matter if you haven't decided yet, you can still choose your contraception. The first method is the contraceptive implant, sometimes known as the rod. The implant is a little white rod about the size of a matchstick, which is placed under the skin of the arm. It gives out a small amount of the hormone progestogen every day. This is the same hormone as in the mini pill or the second hormone in the regular combined pill. This hormone stops the ovaries from releasing an egg. The implant lasts for three years and there is no need to remember to swallow a pill every day. As soon as it is removed, you can fall pregnant straight away. The implant can, however, give irregular periods. This means that some women have no periods or infrequent periods, but some can have two periods a month or a bit of spotting most days. It is easily inserted. We first numb the area of the arm with a little bit of local anaesthetic, a sting. We could also use an anaesthetic cream if you prefer. Then it takes less than one minute to slip it beneath the skin. You will feel some gentle pushing, but it will not be sore. The implant can be felt, but it is not usually visible. Someone in the hospital should be able to put this in in the hours or days after you have had your baby. If you are planning to have a caesarean section, we may be able to put it in when you are in the operating theatre or on the postnatal ward afterwards. If you are planning to breastfeed, there is good evidence that the implant does not interfere with breastfeeding your baby. Another long-lasting method is sometimes known as the coil, the copper coil, or the IUD. It is placed in the womb and can stay there for five years, although some can last for 10 years. It gives out copper, which kills off the sperm when they enter the womb, so they cannot fertilize the egg. It may make periods a bit heavier or more painful. As soon as it is removed, you can fall pregnant straight away. If you are having a caesarean section, a doctor should be able to put a coil in at the time of the surgery after the baby is delivered. You will not be able to feel this. If we can't do this or you have a vaginal delivery, we will give you an appointment to come back and have this done. The marina also known as the intrauterine system, or IUS, is placed in the womb 
like the copper IUD. It lasts for five years. The marina, however, contains the hormone progestogen, like the mini pill and implant. The progestogen makes the mucus that you produce from your cervix thick and sticky, which prevents sperm from getting to the egg. The hormone also causes the lining of the womb to thin and change so that it would not support a pregnancy. It tends to take periods away or make them very light. Many women like this. Women who have a marina put in after having a baby can also benefit from less postnatal bleeding. As soon as the marina is removed, you can fall pregnant straight away. Like the copper coil, if you have a caesarean, it should be possible to put the marina in at the same time. You will not feel this happening as you will be numb from the anaesthetic for the caesarean and it will only take a couple of minutes. This is a good option for you if you are interested in long-acting contraceptive methods but are a bit nervous of having them fitted. If it is not possible to do this at the time of caesarean section or if you have a vaginal delivery, we will give you an appointment to come back and have this done. There is also Depo Provera or the JAG. This is an injection which is given every 12 weeks, usually into your bottom. It is a dose of the hormone progestogen which is enough to last for 12 weeks when the next injection is due. It keeps the ovaries quiet so that you do not release an egg. In most women it eventually takes periods away which many women like. Sometimes it can take a while for your periods to start again after you stop it. So we usually advise women to stop it well in advance of planning another baby. In some women however it can cause weight gain. It also causes a small amount of bone thinning when you first start it but this should go back to normal when it is eventually stopped. The midwives in the hospital can give you your first injection after you have your baby and you can see your practice nurse or GP after that. Like the other methods we have talked about, it will not interfere with breastfeeding. Women tell us that it can be hard to find time to think about contraception after their baby is born and hard to get to their GP or practice nurse to talk about options. We hope that by giving you some time to think about this now and offering as many options to you in hospital as possible, we can make life a little bit easier for you. If you are interested in any of these methods, then please ask your midwife about them. If it is not possible to insert them when you have had your baby, we will advise you on clinics that you can attend to have this done as soon as possible.